What's up guys with a quick video here today because I haven't done many videos lately. <laughs> I haven't had much of a need because of the shows, but I'm going to be getting back to it very shortly. One thing about my channel is I get videos out constantly to you guys, and there hasn't been a week off this entire year I haven't done one. So yeah, this is my first one of this year, for updates at least, I think. Because January 2016 is nearing its climax. In fact, this week is its climax. And I think I have to bring a few things that up to the forefront um, before we go any for further. Number one, I have gotten a new intro that you had seen at the start of this video. That's right, I have created my very own intro with a site. I plan to upgrade from that further on, but for now, this is what I can get. And as time goes on, my intro will get better. Trust me. Another thing I have to talk about here is the fact that I have a lot of projects on my plate right now. And I'm going to just have to address this. I have a problem with getting back to these projects. You have no clue how many unfinished um, projects I have in my backlog. You have no clue. Once when I wanted to do Nickelodeon History, once when I wanted to review Teen Titans Go, at one point I remember wanting to review a regular show for some weird, weird reason. Um, one, um, that Simpsons project, which is probably the, my biggest project right now I'm taking on, and I'm hoping to get that out by March. But I doubt I can. On other notes, Simpsons vlogs may be on hold. Because here's the thing. I can't just say the same things about every possible episode. And... As time and time has gone on with The Simpsons and me, I feel like I'm. it's much more of a watch on my own kind of show, not a discuss on the internet kind of show. On a similar manner to that note, though, Steven Universe vlogs, I am dropping the vlog format for them. I'm moving on to streams, and that for the last episode of Gravity Falls when that comes out. Because those are my big shows right now. And the question I'm having for myself is what shows I'll cover after. Now, I last year, I dabbled a little bit with live action programming and reviewing that. This year, I'm taking it on yet again. Yes, I am going to be going through many of the shows that Disney and Nick are pooping out. Uh, and... Taking them on. That's right. I'll revisit Bunks, Game Shakers, um, Nicky, Ricky, Dicky, and Don. Touch on some of Disney's ones. And talk about if there can ever be a saving grace for them. I also want to work on a new channel trailer. My channel trailer absolutely sucks. Because that was old me. Before I was this serious of a, this critical of a critic, you can say that I have extremely high expectations for my shows. But then again, that, yeah. As I may have stated before, I'm not going to be deleting any of the videos off my channel, but update them, I will. Both Sadie Song and Onion Friend need updates on my channel because I changed my opinions on both of them. And yeah, I'll probably be alone in plenty of these camps. I also want to, before Gravity Falls ends, review every episode from that show and get a little backlog of those on my channel. 
So yeah, that'll be a project on my hands too. I have so many projects in the similar vein to that, but only after the Gravity Falls things have finished production, Steven Universe will be getting their classics vlog series too, including some of the revisits of some previous episodes so I can give my much better opinions on some of them. I also want to dabble in video games a bit. Yeah, I've talked about that quite a few times now. And yeah, I've never thought of my channel as a specifically animation channel. I've only mainly kept that as a focus. And as a focus, yeah, I need a bit of an upgrade there. Cartoons are going to still be my main thing. However, I want to dabble a lot more in the kids programming that there is out there and stuff like that alongside give my personal experiences with it because trust me i am not like most kids as far far as their content that they watched oh i know old nick not the 90s nick but early 2000s nick yeah i know it quite well and i'll explain that and stuff not only that, but under my belt, I also want to do two videos on Nick, Cartoon, no, three videos, Nick, Cartoon Network, and Disney, talking about the shows they have on there right now, and stuff like that. I also want to do some movie reviews, which I have done before. I've dabbled with a bit of James Bond and stuff like that. However, I want to go full theory-ish stuff on this. You see, I want to make a theory video on Jurassic Park. And I'm when I make theories, I've changed my mind on what I'm going to do for them. I'm not doing theories on the actual movies or shows that I review, do it. No. I am doing this for why this is this. My Jurassic Park one. Why does Jurassic Park have an obsession with kid characters? Because it's something I really want to talk about really badly. Family Guy can now get renewed for vlogs occasionally. I now am going to probably watch a few episodes of it again. Even though I'm not that e even that big of a fan. But cover even a bit of Family Guy. After all, on my channel, I want plenty of shows covered. And it's not just a clickbait. But, yeah. Finally, to round this all out, I am going to tell you about a series I am working on. Yes, I actually have two series projects. I'm doing one review series and one actual thing that I hope to turn into a webcomic. The first one is called Cartoon Executioner, which is going to be my nostalgia critic like series without clips. I plan to introduce my very own sense of humor to it, and yeah, see how it goes. I'm doing five episodes of that, and that's where I'm going to cover plenty of my um, shows that you guys want me to do. Yeah, I'm covering that. Anyway, guys, thanks so much for watching this long, long video. I just had so many things I had to get off my mind and add to the, what I need to do for 2016. I want to finish plenty of those projects. In fact, you can say that I will finish plenty of them. Although, it'll be a lot more work than I think it will be. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching my video. Enjoy my new intro. Enjoy me changing my channel on its head, pretty much. Because around this time last year, my channel was nowhere near as good as it is now. I have over 10,000 views overall on my channel. That's huge for me. And I have over 75 subscribers. Also huge 
for me. Of course, I couldn't do all of this without your help. You guys have been so, so great for this. Accepting, a, accepting plenty of things that I've been a bit of an exception on compared to most people. Like the kid reviewer, um, vlog style pretty much. But, I'll plan to work my channel up even further. I'm the Nostalgia Critic, or not really, but no, I'm the Entertainment Lord, and see you all next video.